There's a group of artists that get together regularly to create one of the church's most ancient types of art. They're called the Icon Guild of Southern California. Icons are painted images of saints, angels, and the divine, but created with painstaking detail. The class is normally composed of experienced painters and craftsmen, but today they have a new student. And I'm completely out of my element. It's 7.30 in the morning on a Saturday on a weekday, on a Saturday. Today I'm gonna to do something I've never done before. It's outside of the art I normally create. I'm a graphic designer and normally, you know, my art style is very minimal, modern, clean. But today, I'm gonna to take an eight hour class at Beckett Studios on iconography painting. Holy Spirit, enabling him to represent your most holy mother, the one who held you in her arms and said, protect them from all evil and instruct them in good counsel. This I ask through the intercession of your most holy mother, the Apostle Luke, and all the saints. Amen. With icon painting, you start from dark to light because that's how the spirit and the person comes to Christ. And as we get closer to God, we reflect God more so. And so the image is to reflect God in us. Well, that'll dry a little lighter, but um, the idea when you're doing rose crush is to do small circles. And that way it disperses the grains. Thank you, sir. Oh, that's perfect. They play this ancient monk chant music while we're painting, and it almost takes you to a different world. It's like stepping back in time. The people around you melt away, and it's just you and that icon. It's almost a meditation. You go, how can I become more patient? Or how can I better communicate with God? Or how can I represent these virtues to other people? It's a blessing for us now to have this craft that was developed so long ago. It has brought a focus to prayer. It has brought a focus to my life. That's the prayer, is to be open to the gift of the Spirit. Eight hours later, and I uh, have a much deeper appreciation for iconography work. When you see this in a church or a cathedral and you walk right by it, you really don't have a chance to admire the detail. You know, I'm a newbie, I came in today, so I had to do mine on paper. But they've been working on these for months, and at the end it looks beautiful. There's layers and layers and layers of patient effort on top of here, and that's something that I did not know before coming to this class.